Are turkeys really pumped up on hormones and steroids? On a real turkey farm like mine, you'll find the answers. Let me show you around. Come on inside. Today's turkeys are larger in size to feed more people than in past generations. In the early 1930s, most turkeys were medium to large in size with a narrow breast and without much meat on the bone. Responding to customers' demand preferring more white meat, selective breeding over generations of turkeys has produced larger birds with more breast meat. We breed the birds with the best genetics in order to get the most desirable traits. Those traits efficiently convert their feed into meat, leg strength, and an overall larger frame size to support a meatier breast. Turkeys grow healthy, feeding on a corn and soybean diet with vitamins and minerals. Steroids cannot be used, and hormones can't be added either. Adding steroids or adding hormones to poultry is against federal law, and they're also not needed. They would not be effective in a bird's digestive tract, and it wouldn't be practical to inject each turkey in a whole flock of thousands. Today's turkeys thrive because of a balanced diet of corn and soybeans, healthy growth, and good breeding.